Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm I'm feeling a little under the weather. <laughs> I feel like I should not have this much makeup on considering how I feel. But yeah, if you don't like people that sniffle, then get out right now. <laughs> um, I'm going out of town this week. Hopefully, if all goes well and I get a little better. Uh, but the kids have been sick. All of last week and this week, both kids, like they were home from school every single day. Um, and so obviously I got sick. But I'm, since I'm going out of town, I really don't want to like fall behind. So I wanted to film a haul. And I'm actually probably going to film a couple of hauls. So let's just call this Fashion Week on YouTube. You know, like, well, on my YouTube channel, I guess. Because you're probably going to get three hauls in a row. Maybe not, though. Maybe I'll switch it up and... Uh, you know, I'll feel a little better before I leave and I can film a different video for you guys. But um, I know you like hauls and I have been shopping like you would not believe uh, because I have something special planned for this weekend. So I'm hoping that, um, you know, I'll probably end up wearing some of this stuff, but that's okay. You guys can act like it's the first time that you've seen it when I show it to you next time. Uh, but the first thing that I want to show you is actually from Swimsuits for All. And this is part of the new Gabby Fresh collection. She uh, always collaborates with, I think it's Swim Sexy, and then Swimsuits for All sells it. And I loved this particular piece. Normally I buy like five or six of the swimsuits, but I always had so much trouble with the sizing because while you can get the tops and the bottoms two different sizes, which is nice, this is obviously one piece, so it's only one size. Um, but the tops would always run so small because it was like a D double D, and then I think the next size up was like an E, F or something? I don't remember. But um, the cup sizes were always tiny, 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 tiny. So this year, I actually ordered this before I found out that they fixed the cup sizes. So um, this is a D double D, and I still sized up, obviously, since I had no idea that the um, that the sizes were more on point now. Um, and I got this, I want to say I got it in a 22. I did. So I got it in a 22 D double D and uh, typically I'm like a size 16, 18 and I have, I think I'm like a, I'm a 42 C or a 40 D on top. So this fits me really well, but there's definitely room up here. Like it really just kind of covers my boob. I don't have any cleavage or anything, but I still think it looks good. So I'm super happy with it. It has like the mesh on the sides. I love the way that it fits. Um, I just, I love everything about it. I love the, how it clasps in the back. I think it's beautiful. It's a great quality. And I cannot find the receipt, but I think they're like 60 bucks. But Swimsuits for All always has, um, they always have coupons. So maybe it's listed at like 100 and I got it for 60. Uh, but they constantly have sales. Like, I've never bought anything from them that wasn't on sale. So to go with that, <clears throat> I also purchased this like cover up. I think it's called a, a caftan? Caftan? I don't know what it's called. But it's got like a... Um, like almost like a skirt basically but the sides are open and uh, when I got mine the button was broken off so I have to sew the button back on um, so for now I'll just tuck it into the swimsuit to show you guys but then it comes together kind of like a robe and you can tie it and it's stretchy and it's beautiful and it's just like this pretty 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 like maroon color with these gold like almost like paintbrush strokes all over it I think it's beautiful I know it also comes in black and her collection was really cute this year but I am, okay, I'm, I am trying to cut back on swimsuits. That being said, I bought five swimsuits this week, so I'll be showing them all to you. I, I'm trying to cut back, though. Normally, I rack up at least 20, 25, 30 swimsuits in a swimsuit season, you know what I'm saying? But I get them because I want you guys to see them and see how they fit and stuff, because I know that you're not going to buy 30 swimsuits. You know, you're going to buy one or two or whatever. So I want you to get the right one. So these are absolutely beautiful. The sizing is far... Um, far more on point than it ever is <clears throat> and the quality feels great. I'm really into it. It does have underwire I wish it was padded. Of course, it's not gonna be padded um, Most big girls don't need padding in their bra, but your girl does but that's okay. It still looks cute. So um, Very very excited with that purchase and um, the rest of the stuff is from ASOS or ASOS however people say it <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so I was trying to create like a sleek kind of outfit and I was trying to create a certain type of outfit really. A sleek one is what I had in my head but it, it did not happen. So I saw this really pretty dress and this is a River Island dress and I ended up getting it in a UK 34, no, a UK 24 which is a US 20. Now I knew it was gonna be a little bit big but they didn't have a size 18, they only had a 16 and a 20 and it's like a faux wrap dress. It almost is a wrap dress because the front does come apart basically, but 
Um, you can't completely take the dress apart. I just thought it was so pretty. It almost looked like it uh, looks look like it almost looks like tattoo print, which I just thought was so pretty. And it's like this like peachy kind of color, and it has like um, like an opening on the arm, and it's so flowy and pretty. And I wanted something dainty and cute like this, but it is huge on me. Like I can rig it up, and I can pull it up and pull it back, and kind of tie everything together in the back, but it looks janky. Um, and then it's kind of cute, you know. But the actual quality is amazing. I think it's a beautiful dress, and I should have just gone with the size um, 16. I definitely would have fit that one. Um, so I'll pro I'm definitely not going to keep it. I'm going to be exchanging it. This is a tunic top with side splits and curve hem. And oh, there's no price in here, but I think it was like 50 bucks. But ASOS did have a sale when I shopped. So um, they are kind of expensive. Like they have nice stuff, but it is kind of expensive. Um, so then I also picked up this. I loved. I fell in love with it when I saw it on the website. Uh, this is a US size 18 and it has like the cold shoulder on it and it's just like a long sleeve black top with a high neckline kind of like a mock turtleneck and it's completely ribbed very 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 stretchy I want to say this was like in the 20 or 30 dollar range um, but it is really cute it fits really nice like uh, it, it just feels really nice against my skin so I'm really into that one I thought that was cute oh and if you're not familiar with ASOS I guess I should say this they are, um, I believe, a UK brand, uh, so they ship internationally, and the shipping is really fast, especially if you opt for the two-day shipping, which is like $19 for a whole year of two-day shipping, and it actually only took one day to get to me, um, but the shipping is really fast, it's easy to return stuff, and they have really high-quality stuff. They have um, a ton of different brands, so it's not that like ASOS itself is its own brand, but they carry a bunch of different brands. Um, on the store on the site so it's really dope and they have a uh, plus size clothes and they have straight size clothes they have men's clothes and it's just it's really great so I'm a big fan of ASOS I just don't shop with them super often I don't know why I guess probably because they are a little bit pricier um, but I shop at Torrid all the time so that doesn't even make sense okay so next up I got this what is this one called oh that was not what <laughs> Did I tell you guys? See, I'm tripping. I told you guys that the dress was called the tunic top with side splits and curve hem. That's what this is. The dress, that didn't even make sense. The dress was called the River Island Plus Floral Print Floral Print Tea Dress. See, I'm tripping. I'm not even on drugs today. Like, I purposely didn't take any drugs, but I'm a little bit out of it. So this I got because I'm obsessed with the side split tees. You guys know that. And it looks so cute on the model. So I got this in a US size 18. And it's just like this dark, um, this dark gray. And it is also ribbed. It's not as stretchy as the other shirt. Not that it's not stretchy, but... Um, it's just very loose to begin with. It's very wide, it's very loose. The split does not go that high and I feel like it's just not right for me. Like it's too big, it's too loose. I like for it to come in at my waist and to really accentuate that part and then split. But this one has like the splits too low and then it's just too loose on me. Like I don't like loose clothes like that. So if you do, check that shirt out. But if you don't, girl, okay. This has got to be my favorite thing ever. Oh my gosh, I love it. So um, I was really on the fence about buying it because it was kind of expensive. Um, and uh, But then I remembered that I didn't buy a jacket this year. I didn't buy a coat at all. Um, I didn't buy new Uggs. I didn't buy like anything that was wintry. So I saw this and I immediately fell in love with it. And it's like this deep army green, like, well, more like an olive, I guess. And um, they call it khaki. I got this in a size US 18 and this is uh, again another piece by River Island and it is this beautiful coat like oh it's so pretty you guys and the details are all silver so it does fit really well um, even my arms which a lot of times I have trouble with stuff fitting my arms but it's a beautiful jacket I'm so in love with it I think it was listed at like $150 um, again, I did have like a coupon or something that day. I want to say I got like $75 off of my order. So um, it wasn't too bad, but I think I ended up like still spending like $200. So, um, you know, it's kind of a lot. I did also get, oh, I forgot. I also got a pair of shoes. I completely forgot what these shoes look like. What did I get? Oh, I got these to wear with that dress because I thought they would be cute. And I wanted something that wasn't a high heel. <clears throat> but then I tried them and I'm just I need a high heel like if I'm gonna wear heels I want to wear heels like I want at least four or five inches um, Otherwise to me it looks just so casual and it's kind of like odd to me um, but 
These I thought were so cute when I saw them on the website. These are actually a wide width shoe and um, they have like a nice chunky heel on them and then they kind of lace up around your leg. And I thought they were so cute. They're like this really pretty, um, almost like a pale pink. It is, it is a pale pink, like it looks really just very like neutral here, but um, it is a pale pink and I thought they were so cute and they are really comfortable, but because they're wide width, they ended up being too big on me. So um, these I got in a size nine, which I, I was, was it nine or eight? I think I got it in eight and a half. No, I got it in a nine because it says UK seven. See, and you guys told me last time UK seven means US nine. So no, I must have got it in a size nine. So they are a little bit too big for me, but that tends to happen for me. Um, I am always a nine, but when it comes to wide with shoes, it's like, <clears throat> it could be anything. I could be an eight, I could be eight and a half, I could be a nine, I don't know. But I thought they were so cute and they're so comfortable. Um, it's always a gamble when I get wide with shoes because sometimes the nines fit, sometimes I have to size all the way down to an eight, sometimes an eight and a half works. Um, it's really always a gamble. So these ones I would say run a little big. If you don't have a really wide foot, um, which I don't, I can typically slip into like, you know, a normal size nine, like, um, you know, a normal width. Um, I would size down, but they are really pretty. They are really nice quality. They feel super comfortable when you're wearing them. Super easy to walk in because it's a short, chunky heel. So if you're nervous about wearing heels, this is like a really great option for you because there's so much stability here. Um, and then it looks so cute when you lace it up your leg or if you just wrap it around your ankle, whatever you want. And they're just like so cute for spring, like cute little spring dresses. So that's why I got them, but um, I'm gonna have to exchange them for a different size, but... That's it for this particular haul. So this was just um, ASOS and I just sound horrific, you guys. Like, I hope that you enjoy these videos even though I sound crazy because I am gonna film a couple of them because I really don't wanna fall off and I want you guys to be able to see this stuff before it like leaves the website and I'm gonna be gone forever. So I'm trying, guys, bear with me. Give me a thumbs up if you feel my pain because I know everybody's been sick. Everybody's been getting like stomach flus and. Um, just all kinds of different nasty coughs and everything going around and I'm tired y'all. I wanted to go away I wanted to go away and I tried out new lashes today and they're so lightweight But I realized like I can't even open my eyes because I'm sick um, But I hope that you guys enjoyed the haul if you have any questions as always leave them down in the comments Let me know what your favorite thing was. Um, I'm obsessed with that swimsuit. It's so cute uh, but I think that that's all I have for you guys so Keep tuning in. I have a fashion to figure and a torrid haul coming really soon and a boohoo haul, eek, like big old hauls. <laughs> so um, make sure that you're subscribed. A lot of you have mentioned that you don't get my um, videos in your subscription boxes anymore. So if you wanna make sure that you don't miss any, then you can go ahead and hit that little uh, bell that's like buy a subscription box and that will give you a notification every time that I upload, which is not that often. So don't worry, I'm not gonna be blowing up your phone. But that is all that I have for you guys. I hope that you enjoyed the video and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.